Hey everybody, thanks so much for tuning in to Sonoran Scale Studios. If this is your first time here, before you leave, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. Click the bell so you don't miss any future upcoming content. Today we are at the skate park doing something a little different. Got the Rustler out again. This is the Rustler 4x4 VXL, the newest brushless version. Picked up in early 2021. This thing's been around for a couple decades for good reason. It's a common platform, shares a lot of components and parts with a few of Traxxas, other very popular models, including the Slash and the Stampede, which have both been around for a very long time. And then now the newly introduced Hoss also shares a lot of the same platform um, parts. So this is just a, a really good truck running it on a 3S pack, stock tires, 15 tooth pinion, splitting the difference between the 11 tooth that comes installed and the 20 tooth that Traxxas includes. But just showing what it can do at the skate park, it, um, it's a super fun truck to use. Um, it's very user friendly, it's durable, it's fast, it will backflip as you can see here. It jumps nice, it handles well. Uh, it takes a beating today. It's about 110-ish degrees, and it has some rough landings with nothing broken, so two thumbs up in the durability department. Um, just a note before I leave you to enjoy some more of the run footage from the day regarding using skate parks. They are a lot of fun for an RC user, but bear in mind that we represent the hobby when we're out. And, um, you know, this hobby has a very good reputation and for good reason, and we wanna keep it that way. And one thing to keep in mind is that a skate park is not designed or created with the intent for RC cars. So I myself only try to use the park if no one is there. If someone does come while I'm filming, I talk to them, ask them if they mind if I keep filming and just kind of finish up before I go. Nine times out of 10, nobody ever has a problem with it. Actually, most of the time people think it's really cool and they wanna watch. Basically, in my experience, I've found that if you show some respect and courtesy up front, you will experience no issues. Pretty toasty. There she's. Straight into the fire. Straight into the side of our car. <laughs> <laughs> Through the window. Breaks. Look at it go with nothing. Giving it no trigger. Just autopilot. <laughs> wow. So personally, I've found with the Rustler that while it does include the self write feature, the only times I have had success using the self write feature was when I was not using the stock tires, but when I was using larger, heavier, monster truck size MT tires in either Duratrax or I've had some pro lines on here and even had some bigger tracks on here and you just need more rotational mass for that self right to really work. Um, maybe it will from time to time here or there but on most surfaces I've had no success so just a note um, it is a nice feature but it's not nearly as useful as it is on say the max or uh, the x max <laughs> 